Okay, so, um, I am Squarks, I'm reading Spiders Is by, um, Argim Barger, whatever. Um, I figured since I haven't read anything past chapter 2, I'd read the last three chapters, just one after another, one video, just go for it. So, jumping right into this shit pile, chapter 3, Thirdly Happens. Alf the spiders run away from Twilight and Red Spider Mac and Tehi didn't know what to do because they were so many spiders of the eggs. Big Mac said, hey you spider babies, you are my spider babies, now listen to me. And but the spider babies didn't listen because they were making too much noise, but if but they would listen if they could because Mac Spider was their daddy and they loved him and their mummy Twilly took it more than any of the bugs, even the juicy ones. Big Mac Spider said to Twilight Spider, I am so sorry, I am the worst spider daddy, even though I promised I was going to be the best one, even sad face. Twilight felt really bad and sorry for the Big Mac Spider, because she knew that he tried his best, and but if there wasn't a biggest problem happening, she would give him the hugs. Twilight thought hardest with having ideas, and then had one idea. Spider Big, come here and help me, okay? And Spider Max said, Est, alright, what do you want me to do, Twilight, and? Twilight said, I need you to throw me into the spiders. And Red Max said, are you sure? Question mark, question mark, question mark, question mark, question mark, dash, question mark. You tohu good. Spiders were creepy and weird. And Twilight said, I know, Momo. But I need to do this, okay, because Big Mac, we are spiders, and Big Mac said okay. Big Mac picked her up by... Big Mac picked her up by her legs with his legs, and there were at the spider's babies. She screamed a little bit, but not really, because she was trying to be brave like Rainbow Dash would be brave if she was a spider and flying at spider babies. <laughs> and finally, after falling for a time, she landed in... Tess Pider babies, and they didn't know she was their mom because they were still just babies and crawling and 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 Twilight Spider tried to click at them to stop, but they didn't know what to do because these because babies are confused, sad face. By the way, every time I actually say sad face, there's actually a sad face written like a colon um colon bracket sad face. Big Mac watched all the babies carry Twilight away, and then he fell to the most terrible and said and said, It is my fault that Twilight being carried away by spider babies, because I was the one who had spider sex with her, and she made babies because sad face. I have to rescue her, he said. Okay, that was chapter two. Or, chapter three. Wow, this thing is making me actually retarded. Okay, chapter four, Fluttershy. Oh god. Oh, I'm sorry, chapter 4, when spiders are... I don't like this, Twilight Spider thought. I wish Big Mabg were here. He knows what to do every time. But Big Mac were chasing her and the spider poppies, and she didn't know it. It was very exciting. All the spiders ran through Equestria, and all the ponies were scared and ran into the house, but except one pone who stood in Test Street and angry. Stop, spiders, she said, and they stopped. And Big Brown Spider jumped off her head. Her head was gray, and her coat was gray, too, and her hair was straight T. And the spider was bonor and big and made an angry click. Twilight heard the clicks and clicking and knew that the spider had a name. Miriam We- Mer Miriam Webster? Really? <laughs> Fuck. Knew the spider had a name. Miriam Webster. And Miriam Webster's spider told all the baby spiders to stop being bad. Tehi couldn't do what they did because what they did was something bad to do. And they had to stop and listen to the mommy spider like spiders do every- Twilight Mom Spider thought Rilla hard, and all the baby spiders watched her, and Big Mac got over where she was and said, Twilight, I'm so glad you're okay. And Twilight said, Shh, I'm thinking. And Big Mac's miter, Mac, said, 
Oh, okay, sorry. Twilight said, I love you, baby spider, but you did bad thing and made my friend Spike dead. Why did you do that? And please, so go make Spike better, and then go to Everfree Forest where you belong as spiders. It will be okay. And the spider said, okay, mommy, and they went him back to where Spike was, and they barfed all his juice back, and he was better. Spike said, tank. <laughs> you... I look like there's something written in Klingon. Spike said, Tank, you spiders, you are my best friends. Happy face. And the spiders made a happy face. And then they hugged, but this time they didn't drain all of Spike's vital fluids. Happy face. Since the spiders all listened to Mommy Twilight and wet to Everfree Forest where spiders live happy and free and it was good. Twilight and Big Max Red talked to Miriam and the Grey Pony Listen, The Grey Pony was Pinkie Pie's sister from Cutie Mark Chronicles, and she worked on the rock farm, in case you were wondering. Let that sink in for a second. And Twilight clicked thank you, Miriam Webster, and Miriam Webster clicked okay. Listen, Twilight Spider, I'm a wizard, and I know you and the Big Max Spider are not spiders, but ponies. Who are spiders by accident? Question mark, question mark? Do you want to be ponies again? And that was the end of chapter 5. Kind of left it on a cliffhanger there. Wait, was that chapter 5? One, two, no, that was chapter 4. God damn, I am falling apart here. Alright, chapter 5, the epic conclusion. Okay. Colin Firth, part last. Ten Twilight Spider, I am a wizard, and Yo and the Big Mac Spider are not spiders all, but ponies who are spiders by accident? Question mark, question mark. Do you want to be ponies again? Chapter... Oh, wait, that was a little recap. Oh, very, how nice of them. Chapter 5, The End of Spider End. Twilliden and Big Mac said, Yes, we want to be ponies again, and Miriam said, Okay, here, I will do my spider magic, and the spider magic happened. Twilight and Big Mac were ponies again. They gave each other a big pony hug, and because they were friends from the be beginnings, being spiders together, it was good. Happy face. Miriam clicked, and they couldn't understand it anymore because they were ponies, not spiders. But the gray pony, Pinkie Pie's sister, could understand, and she translated the spider speak to pony speech so they could talk some more. Yes. Miriam said, I hope you learned something from being a spider, and Twilight said, yes, I did. I will always remember... And I am also happy because I make Big Mac friend happy face. And Big Mac said, e yelp. And then Big Mac said, listen, Twilight, about being spiders. And Twilight said, it's okay, Big Mac, I understand. And we can still be very good friends forever, okay? And Big Mac said, okay. Thank you, Miriam, I said. And Miriam said, did you learn anything? And I thought about it really... Whoa, we just switched perspectives there. I think this is first person. Thank you, Miriam, I said, and Miriam said, do you think you learned anything? And I thought about it really extra hard, and I said, yes, I did learn something, but I will tell Celeste about it, okay? And Miriam said, that is fair, and then I saw my bestest friend in the world, Argenbarger. Oh. Who was the most handsome Aelicorn in Equestria, and Arbingerber, whatever, said, Hello, Twilight, it has been a long time, and I feel myself blush killing because of how charming R.M. Barger Alicorn was, and I said, <laughs> and I said, yes, it was, have seen a long time. Do you think we could spend some time alone together? And he said, I don't think so, Twilight, I have lots of important things to do because I am an Alicorn, but maybe someday, okay? I was very sad because he was the nicest Alicorn ever, but I said, I understand, and he flew away and it was amazing. I was so impressed and happy. I was so impressed and amazed and happy that I got to see him happy face. Then I went back to the library and found Spike and gave him the biggest, most happy hug ever because he was happy to see me because I was gone for so long because I was a spider's head face. And I said, Spike, please take a letter. And he said, okay, I will take a letter. And Spike took a letter. Dear Princess Celestia, today I learned that spiders are creepy, but being a spider is better than being dead. Your faithful, your faithful student, Twilight Spackle. At the end, the end of the story, I, you can stop reading now. Thanks for reading my story, Happy Face. All glory to Jude. Um. Yeah, that was spiders. Is um, I don't even know what the hell happened in that last part. There's a little self insert there. There was OSCs running around. There's 
fucking Merriam-Webster spider. Um, so yeah, that was my reading of Spiders. I hope you enjoyed it as much as I didn't.